Welcome back to Cursed Mining and today we are continuing our temperature experiments from the last maintenance video. So we have taken apart my R9280X, cleaned it and reapplied thermal paste. With this process we managed to drop the temperatures by around 5 degrees Celsius, which is nice. But today I want to try something more extreme. I want to remove the stock cooler and build a custom cooler with other fans I have. So what do we need? High power fans and zip ties. <laughs> yep, you heard right, zip ties. This one is going to be a dirty one. So first we have to remove the cooler once again and unplug it. Of course this won't look pretty and you don't want to do this if you still have warranty or want to resell this card. But this card will be mining for me until it dies so it's perfect for the experiment. I'll be using two of the delta fans I took out of the Octomino case for this. And if you want to do this, you have to power the fans from another source because the pins on the GPU are made especially for its own fans, so we don't want to burn those slots out. The deltas are pretty hefty and only have one Molex connector, so it will get its own 6 pin to Molex cable laid out. Other people use strong fans like Noctua's um, industrial fans for this, but it's ultimately up to you. Weaker fans mean less noise but higher temperatures or the other way around. While we are doctoring the fans on the card, mind that you should use good quality zip ties. We don't want melting plastic all over the heatsink. And this was actually not so easy as I thought first, since the heatsink of this one in particular is smaller than others, even though it's very long. I am very sorry for your eyes that I eventually had to switch to blue zip ties, but we won't be winning a beauty contest with this mod anyway. So, how was the saying? If it looks stupid but works, it ain't stupid. So... This is our beauty. And yes, it is ugly, yes it is big, but I really wanted to test this, so let's do it. Mounting is no problem in the open air setup, and we still have enough space. So to conclude, um, in the last video we went from 67 degrees Celsius to 62, 63 by just reapplying thermal paste and cleaning the cart, which was already nice. Now. <laughs> We are at 52 degrees Celsius and I think this is amazing. So we dropped another 10 degrees with this um, Quasimodo mod. This card has never seen numbers below 60 degrees when mining, never. So some disadvantages of course are that the fans you added will be running at 100% all of the time. So if you want to do this with something like Delta fans, it will depend on where your rig sits. So this is not necessarily a living room fan mod. But on this rig, I really don't care about looks when I can have a card this cool, even cooler than the RX ones. And also the good thing is that the deltas are even blowing over the car to the rest of the, the rig, so it's actually helping generally with airflow. Also the R9 was the card heating all the other cards up because it just dumped heat all around it. So it looks ugly now, but it's much better than before. So that is already it for this week. We have built a custom cooler and dropped temperatures immensely. Basically, of course, we turned this card into Frankenstein's monster, but the inside matters and it's much cooler. Thank you for tuning in again. Have a nice week. Please subscribe if you like this video and may your temperatures always be low. Bye.